Hello. So this is just a quick video. I got a new loot crate, as you can see. Boom. And I open it up with a sword I always use. And sorry, my hair is messy. I just woke up a little bit ago, and I'm like, I cleaned up my house a bit. Uh, I haven't showered and everything, obviously yet. But uh, yeah. So excuses. All right. Time to see what's in this bad boy. First impression opening it up. Looks like there is something on the inside of the box. Kind of looks like a, uh, I don't know, bookshelf of some sort with a bunch of stuff in it. Pretty neat. Let's see what's inside the box, shall we? The shirt, first and foremost, is from the TV show Stranger Things. <laughs> it's pretty cool, actually. So that's the Stranger Things t-shirt. Pretty intense. I actually really like this shirt. I'm definitely going to use it. Probably today. Um, a color changing mug. I'm guessing when it gets warm, it changes color. Let's see what it looks like. It looks like it's going to be Batman themed. If the outside of the box is telling. Which, I mean, how much straightforward, how much more straightforward can you get than the Batman symbol? Come on. It's packaged up in tissue paper. What's funny is I'm actually using a mug right now. Um, because I'm drinking coffee. Here's the other side of the mug that I'm currently using. I don't know where I got this thing, but it's pretty neat. Tim Burton's Nightmare Before Christmas. Alright. Now to see the mug I got out of the box. It looks like a mug of Gotham City. And I'm not sure what it turns into. Maybe Gotham City on fire. But there's... I'll slowly go around. But yeah, maybe it turns into Gotham City on fire with the bat symbol in the sky. I don't know if the, I don't I don't know. I don't think I can transfer the coffee to this mug without spilling. So I'm just gonna leave it at that. Maybe I'll come back and uh, yeah I don't know. Either way, that's pretty neat, and it changes colors when it heats up. So. That was cool. I think it'll be cooler when I actually use it. Alright. It looks like a Jessica Jones. I actually really like that TV show. Um, miniature. In a box. And I don't open these boxes. I actually save them to keep them in mint condition. It's a cute fig of Jessica Jones kicking down a wall. Which is pretty neat. Because I don't know if you've seen Jessica Jones on Netflix, but... It's a pretty amazing TV show, to be honest. It's another Marvel superhero. One that doesn't like being called a superhero. Alright, it looks like X-Files pencil set. Each pencil has a different saying on it. The truth is out there. I want to believe. Trust no one. That's why they put the I in FBI. Cool. But yeah, I don't know if you can see that. Uh, you can't really read it. But either way. X-Files. So, okay. The theme I'm getting from this is investigative uh, work. Because Batman is an expert investigator. Jessica Jones is a private eye um, for hire that just so happens to be a superhero. Um, and X-Files, obviously, they're investigating extra extraterrestrial activity. 
You get the normal Loot Crate magazine, which I'm not really going to go through. The normal Loot Crate pin, which in this case looks like it's a cassette recorder. It's right there. And a small little pencil sharpener, which I will probably never use. So that I'm kind of like whatever about. But it is a tiny, tiny, tiny pencil sharpener. All right. And that is pretty much that. I mean, the, the mug was kind of cool. The shirt was very cool. The rest of it, no, I mean, even the figurine. But I don't know. I feel a little bit lackluster about this loop crepe. Um, not that it's horrible. Just that for the money, I think that it was probably worth it but not worth it to me so someone who gets a little more kick out of this sort of stuff might like it better but this this month i feel like i really like the shirt the rest of it i mean the the statue and the uh mug were decent the rest of it was kind of like eh so but either way I don't feel like it was a waste per se, and it will go with my collection. At some point, I plan on uh, maybe getting a bookshelf and putting all this stuff up for display so you can actually see it rather than a pile next to a mirror in my room. <laughs> so that's basically this month, and I hope you enjoyed it.